welcome shave fans well it's been a few days since I shaved my beard off with the straight razor and uh, of course I had to promise that I would grow it right back for my wife and uh, but I've gotten to the point now where at least I can see it enough that I can uh, shave and and start lining it out and it'll actually look somewhat like a beard so for today the way I'm going to break my fast on shaving is that I'm going to use some of the Your Best Face Luxury Shave Cream. And this is the special edition. And it is a Blue Oil Trio, Peppermint, and Rosemary. Let's see if I can get it so you guys can maybe see that. Mm. And I have no idea what Blue Oil Treatment is, but the uh, shave cream has kind of a kind of a bluish greenish tint to it and the smell is really interesting you definitely get some peppermint and rosemary in there but then there's this like earthy tone which I'm assuming has something to do with that uh, the blue oil so I am gonna get it started uh, I have to say since I, you know, got one of the, uh, well, several of the, the full-size containers of this, you know, the packaging is, is really top-notch. These little containers are, uh, I don't think that it's glass, but some sort of really heavy plastic. Um, so a really nice little container. The labels are, of course, beautiful and well-made. And uh, I just am really impressed more and more with this company of course i know that i like their shave cream um, having used some samples before but uh, yeah to get the actual product in my hand it uh, really lives up you know it's 100 percent professional so one of the cool things about this shave cream it's how little you actually use. You start with your face warm and wet. And then you just get a little teeny bit. And start kind of massaging that in. You just want to create a slick. If you get so much like up here where you can see it, you probably have a little too much. So you just barely want to be able to see some sort of, uh, you know, change in color on your skin is what I found works best for me. If you get too much, it can uh, kind of clog up your razor a little bit, you know. And it's just so nice and slick. So since I got quite a bit of beard, I will add a little bit more than I normally would. But still, I want a nice thin layer and I want to keep it wet. So since I live in the desert, sometimes the keeping it wet part can be not really challenging, but you'll see that uh, sometimes I'll go back and just kind of dip in and get my fingers wet and make sure that I've got a good slick going. And then in between each shave, I'll add, um, go back to the pot and add just a little bit of the shave cream. You need even less the uh, second, third pass. All right. So since uh, I've got a pretty decent amount, I'm going to be using my Icon 101 on the Maggard MR5 handle. Uh, really one of my all-time favorites. And I have a Dorco blade in here. And it's been long enough since I shaved. I don't remember exactly how many uses I have on that, but we will see. I'm going to start with open comb to get all the beard off.
Nice first pass there. So now for the second and then the third pass, I'm just going to wet it down in between each pass and then uh, pull out some of the shave cream and just do a super duper thin layer. Really just going for slick on it. So I will uh, meet you on the other side and we'll talk a little bit more about some your best face products that I've been trying out lately.
that another awesome shave and uh, with your best face and their luxury shave cream and this uh, special edition blend is definitely gets my thumbs up it's uh, it's I don't know really how to describe that scent other than you know it's earthy with peppermint and rosemary but I really like it it's just uh, you know different from anything I've ever smelled or any other scent I've ever smelled so uh, you know it's I don't know how to describe it to anybody just yummy not like yummy eaty but uh, you know but just a good scent I like it so one of the things I just really dig about uh, using your best face is that uh, you know there's I don't, I don't have to get a brush involved so it's uh, for me a perfect thing for travel uh, I don't have to deal with a wet brush and uh, all the uh, you know nearly as much prep work as far as getting a lather up or anything and then the same luxury shave cream acts as a uh, post shave balm as well so it's got a bunch of uh, great stuff for your skin in there so a little dab rub it back into your skin and you're good to go and I always seem to get you know effortless and uh, uh, no irritation shaves with the uh, your best face so just a, an absolute joy to use if you guys uh, anybody out there hasn't tried it I definitely recommend it go and check it out I will put a link down below in the description and uh, so that you guys can can uh, see what all they have they I think have 27 cents or so maybe it's 23 well over 20 and I've got with my order that should be coming in any day I will have 10 of them so there is tons to choose from and uh, well I'm a big fan as you can tell all right guys the other thing I wanted to talk about was uh, a lot of what they have uh, for sale on the website are all of these different oils and they're really cool. Okay, this is the uh, Immortel. Let me back that up a little bit. And it's the oil that I've been using uh, just lately. So because I wasn't able to shave, I've just been taking a little bit of this oil, a couple drops, and, you know, rubbing it through the beard and on my skin uh, to kind of, you know, make things soft and nice. And the scent on this is amazing. And it tends to, it lasts with you a little bit. It's not like really strong or anything, but it's just this warm, and uh, sweet scent and I've just really been digging it I was a little concerned about you know when I saw that these came with a little squirt uh, top I thought oh man how am I gonna you know control the amount that comes out because really with an oil you just want like a drop at a time because it spreads so far but uh, what's nice is that this little pump just puts out a drop and uh, so it's just perfect to use so I'll see if I can show you guys a little bit so just a little drop there on and spread it around And so it works great as a beard oil. Uh, it says in the directions, basically, it says use this oil under whatever other products you're going to use. So since I'm already using some of their products, I, I just, you know, we'll do it over the top since I'm talking about it this time. But uh, so typically you would use this under if you were going to be, you know, moisturizing your face or something like that, you use a bit of the oil. 
and then rub it in good and then let your and then do your moisturizer or whatever else that you need but uh, one of the big things is that it's an antioxidant infused oil and me personally I'm not terribly sure what that means for skin so hopefully I can get Daryl to uh, uh, leave his comment down below and, and talk to us about what that means to us uh, I know it's it's something that uh, uh, you know they work really hard at your best face to make sure that all of their products are just absolutely 100% top-notch so uh, I just can't tell you how much this the packaging once again is uh, phenomenal you know a good good packaging with a great label and everything so all right i just had a great share uh, and i smell awesome i will see you guys later